Hi guys, welcome to Cooking with Claudia. Today I'm making homemade biscuits and gravy. Very easy, very delicious breakfast to make. You can always go to the store and get a ready to bake biscuits, but today I'm gonna be making everything from scratch. So let's get started. For the biscuits, I'm using cold unsalted butter. Cold butter is the key to crispy biscuits. I'm also gonna be using some salt, sugar, baking powder, baking soda, and buttermilk. We're also using some flour. First, I'm gonna mix in all the dry ingredients. Next, I'm adding the butter. Then with clean hands, I'm just gonna crumble the butter into the flour. Now I'm gonna stir in the buttermilk until the mixture turns into a moist sticky dough. And I'm gonna transfer the dough onto a lightly floured surface and work it with my hands. Now you want to work this as fast as you can so that the butter does not melt because if the butter melts then we're not going to have nice flaky biscuits. Now I'm going to flatten the dough into a thick surface and cut it out into round shapes. It's easier for me to use a cup but you can use a cookie cutter to cut out your biscuits. Now I'm going to arrange them onto my baking sheet and roll out the remaining dough and keep cutting until there is no more dough. Next, I'm brushing the surface with some egg wash for some shine and crust. I'm gonna poke some holes in the dough to give it a good rise and it's going to bake in a 425 degree oven for 15 to 20 minutes and I'll show you how it looks like when it's done. Biscuit is done and looking good. It's very flaky and the inside is very moist. Now I'm gonna start making the gravy. I'm using breakfast sausage and this is pork. I'm gonna break it up and let it cook and develop a nice color. Now I'm gonna stir in the flour and I'm gonna let this cook with the meat for about a minute. I have the measurements for all the ingredients down in the description box so make sure you check for that. So next I'm gonna stir in the milk and I'm gonna let this cook and thicken up a little bit. And now I'm adding salt and pepper to taste. I'm gonna let this cook for about a minute and it's ready to serve. This looks so good, it smells so good and it tastes even better. You serve this over your biscuits and you have a beautiful bright morning. So just like that it wasn't hard to make at all thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed spending time with me and if you like this video give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos bye